And traffic going to be likely a big problem today if you are trying to get around town. Multiple roadways still closed down due to high water flooding conditions being seen on uh, not only our side streets and frontage roads, but also still our main lanes. It's a bit of a nightmare on 45 North Freeway. This is our view from Franklin this morning where cars are lined up. We have barricades blocking the flooded roads and police officers on the scene directing people away from the flood waters. It's dark out there. Turn around. Don't drown. You do not know how deep that water is that you could be driving into. We saw case after case yesterday where people thought they could get through the flood waters and they couldn't. We had high water rescues being seen all throughout the Houston area. Going into our traffic map now, there's a lot of roadways that are shut down. Those are going to be the ones you see highlighted in purple on your screen. So let's zoom into one of our main inlets out and into town this morning of 45 North Freeway. We have multiple closures uh, here. Again, all of this purple, that's where you cannot pass on. The roadway is blocked because of flooding on Main Street, both ways between Franklin and Wood. So that's in the downtown area. If you're trying to get about this morning, add in extra time because of these closures. Even just a frontage road or two closed down will cause delays. I saw that occur yesterday evening. Going into another road that is blocked uh, because of fallen power lines and cables and flooded roads. Again, electricity and water do not mix very well. 45 northbound exit 48A to exit 50 and Calvocade Street. This will be just inside of the 610 loop trying to get into downtown. You cannot pass there. Another roadway flooding as case that we're watching is a lane that's closed because of flooding on the Gulf Freeway both ways between Dallas Street and uh, the exit to 69 and now to the north side of town we have closures on Beltway 8 exit ramp from Hardy Toll northbound to um, because of flooding uh, that's just one of the incidents here Hardy Toll northbound but then we have lanes on Beltway 8 itself that are highlighted in purple meaning that they are closed so both east and westbound surrounding Hardy Toll are also shut down and we're not done yet uh, we have uh, along the south Beltway 8 a roadway blocked because of flooding uh, frontage road westbound from Hopper Road to Almeda School Road. That is still closed and all the way off in Galveston we still have multiple roads that are still inundated by the water. One of those being three lanes blocked because of flooding on I-45 frontage road southbound at Broadway Street.